today's local and national news from Thailand via the fabulous Patia Media Group. And if you'd be kind enough to like and subscribe, here's a tip for you to get the very latest news from us every day. When you subscribe, click on the button that says All. And then every day you'll get an update straight from us. Storms across the nation continued yesterday and into the night, seeing many regions still flooded. In Sukhothai, a levee broke, seeing more water released and several roads damaged. And with similar damage across the nation, heavy rain is forecast for the north, northeast, central and southern provinces this week. Flooding can be expected in low-lying areas across the country. In the capital, plans are being put into action to control high river levels, with those predicted to rise this week and next. In Nakhon Ratchasima, rescue efforts continued yesterday in an attempt to reach three people buried in a collapsed railway tunnel project under construction there. The word is that sensors have detected life behind the collapsed area and backhoes are being used to clear rubble some four kilometres into the project. No short-term rescue for sure, but with teams working around the clock, it's hoped that at some point air and foodstuffs will be passed through. The plan? Well, it's to use what's called a rescue tube, a small diameter tunnel that will be forced through the rubble, slowly creating a passage to the stranded three. Illegal cheap alcohol, home distilled and sold in black market venues, has been blamed for one man's death and 20 people being hospitalised. With the warning out not to drink the stuff, it's been explained that a main component has been methanol, known in the West as wood alcohol. That's toxic to humans, it's only used commercially. 18 so-called moonshine joints have been closed down by authorities in the capital alone. This is a small factory operation was revealed to be mixing water with methanol before adding flavour. The warning's out today of a major scam that's been on social media and offers high-end hotels to so-called club members in either an online auction or unrealistic prices. The Thai Cyber Crime Investigation Bureau has exposed the fraud which operated on Facebook and Line and is estimated to have reaped over 3 million baht for the scammers. Promising four- and five-star hotels for as little as a few hundred baht, travellers arrive to find either no rooms or substandard ones. Reality is that direct bookings with hotels often gives the best prices. And after that, well, only use recognised booking companies. Meanwhile at home, and our own rescue service, the Sawang Buriboon Foundation, is working with local police forces and City Hall to collect provisions that will be sent to those in flooded regions. All donations are welcome and can be in the form of dried or canned foodstuffs and bottled water. Specifically, cash donations are not being accepted for administrative reasons. Popular drop-off points are Patia City Hall, Patia City Police Station, the Sawang Buriboon Centre and the Stonehouse at Walking Street, with several other points listed as well. The team have large HGV trucks organised to ship all to the north where it's needed. For those who enjoy our news here, thank you very much, and it will remain as it is for the future, with the same production team and reader. As I pass the reins of the morning show over to Megan and Carl from the end of this week, the news will not be affected in any way. With 14 million views on YouTube alone, joining our online and FM listeners, we listen to you. Fab 103 has two new partners joining us soon, and both are committed to making the station even better. And of course, you can still listen globally at our website, alwayspatia.com. And with the Met Office predicting highs today of around 31 degrees, dropping down to 27, another cloudy and overcast day with a good chance of rain, and the real feel expected to be around 37. Local and national news today from Fabulous 103 FM and Fabulous Patia Media Group. And to get a notification every time we release another bulletin or programme, like and subscribe to our channel, Fabulous Patia Media Group, by using the link below.